Hey guys, welcome back, and today is a sort of different video today. It's different in the sense that, it, well, it's a how-to. And specifically, it's a how-to on how to get to Sisica Penitentiary and RDR2 online. So, what you want to do first of all is want to go to the nearest bounty board, and yes, I am dressed up as a lawman, because, like, why not? We're going to Sisica. There's many bounties. And you want to click on Cecil C. Tucker. And you want to click on Cecil C. Tucker, one, because he's close to Saint Denis, which is... A, you know, right next to Sisica. And two, for some reason, during his mission, the kill box that surrounds Sisica Penitentiary deloads. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, usually you cannot get to Sisica Penitentiary in the game. Like, you just can't get there. If you go by ship, it breaks, it sinks, whatever. Go by horse, it runs out of stamina, and you die. But, for some reason in this mission, the kill box just completely deactivates, and you can go there, no problem. I'm going to be showing you how to do that. Just wait for this. Alright guys, so now that we're in the mission, we just want to set a waypoint right here. Now I'd say this is the best spot to go to for uh, to get into Sisica, but it doesn't really matter where you go to, that's just the closest point, so it'll take less time. And I'll get back to you guys when we get there. Alright guys, so I am here, and what you want to do now is you want to look for a boat. Now this can be any size boat, canoe, rowboat, steamboat, even one of the barges. You just need some sort of ship to take you there. And I do recommend doing this at daytime, because ships spawn more often, and at nighttime they're really rare. So just look out for that. And also, if you do like try and do this at nighttime, some points they spawn most frequently is San Denis Harbor and up near Van Horn. I don't know why, and they're still pretty rare, but... Oh, looks like we got lucky, because there's a boat right here. So I'm just going to ride up alongside this guy, and then I'll show you what to do from there. Alright guys, we've just commandeered this guy's boat, and oh! Alright. <laughs> I didn't think we were going to throw him out, I thought he was just going to bail. Right, but now that we have stolen this guy's boat, we're going to set sail directly towards this guy. Am I going the right way? Yeah, due east, okay. So, a bit of information to know before we do this, and hopefully before you guys try this out yourself, is that it has a 50% chance of working. Most of the time, first time you'll try and do this glitch, it won't work. Don't let that deter you, just try it again, and it will work. Okay. So, let's see. Anyway, on the map, I'm just going to show you where the kill box is. It's this big line that goes around Sisica, right here, and I'm tracing out the cursor. That's the kill box, so once you're past there, you know you're golden. And before anyone thinks, oh, I can do this to try and get to, uh, the Grand Kingdom, you can't. I tried it with a friend and it didn't work. You just, you can't do it. And there's some pretty interesting stuff on Sisica as well. I'll show you just, you know, just a bit of it so that you can, you know, go and see it for yourself. And look at that, guys. It seems like we did, well... We didn't hit the kill box, but it just killed us outright. Uh, which means we're just going to have to try it again, unfortunately. But if you're doing this on one, st on one stall of difficulty or any below four, you'll have, more than one you'll have more than one life. So you'll be able to try it again directly. It just turns out for me that I've been doing this so many times that uh, I just don't have any extra lives left. And... Also, it's spawning me so far away. So I'm going to ride back there, get another boat, and I'll show you guys. Alright guys, so I found another ship, and I'm just going to ride out to it. Shouldn't take too long. I want to have the Calvins out. A bit weird. Right, we're just going to steal this guy's boat, and then sail to Sisica. And you see the boats up ahead, sometimes I just like to, you know, paddle up around them. Because I feel like every time I've gotten to Sisica, I've just passed a boat, and I feel like that helps for some reason. This is a superstition of mine, probably doesn't matter, but I just like to just ride up along for the boats and then pass them. Alright guys, so as you can see, I have finally made it to the edge of Sisica. The current's pushing strong, but we're stronger. And... Yeah. I don't know why it's taking so long, this is a bit weird. Like, the boat's super slow. I'm gonna try and boat into the current. Do that help? 
hard to tell which way the current's going, really. Ooh, this is weird. Let me get a slow ride. <laughs> this is weird. I love how there's people on boats right there mocking us. <laughs> yeah, the guards in Sisko really don't do a good job. You saw in the story mode, spoilers ahead, that when you try to even get close in the balloon, they just instantly start shooting. But this, nah, they just let people on boats just swim up, just right to it. No one's even in the watch shot. Wait, is that true? Someone's in the watch tower, okay. Well, we can fix that. We can Okay guys, I forgot to mention, and I, well, didn't really forget, I neglected to mention the fact that there are indeed NPCs on Sisica, which is just insane, really. Like, Rockstar has this in the game, you can never get to it in online, but they just keep everything loaded in. So what we're going to do is we're going to climb up to it and just, you know, check it out. Yeah, this is what the guards look like at Sisica. And they do have like, really nice outfits, and they are different from the ones at uh, San Denis, which I didn't know. The hat matches my outfit perfectly. Look at that. I'm just going to look at the place with my sniper. We got a guard over here. And yeah, there's prisoners too, so let's go and check that out. And I will demonstrate the very hand something pretty cool that you can do. Speaking of the cool things you can do on Sisica, listen to this. And look at that. You can call your horse on Sisica. Now, if you had to ask me why, I think it's because in the code of the game, you do like races here if you do if you do the race series. So I think the game just kept like the AI for calling horses in. So it just allows the horse to come to Sisica, which really is just great. It really makes traveling and traversing the place a lot faster, especially since it's like a massive island. Like, look at it. Just trying to find a prisoner. Yeah, well, there's nothing really going on. The guards don't aggro on you. If you just ride around, they don't mind. Even if you, like, beat up the prisoners, they don't care. Which I think is just really interesting. And here... Yeah, there's a tunnel right here. Sometimes it loads in, other times it doesn't. If you can see down there, there's stuff. There's, like, building that loads in. But... We can't go in through it yet. And I'll... If I can get a guard, I'll show you... What happens... If you try and go in there. You just kind of, mm, you just kind of fall through the map, and it's just, it just isn't a fun time. Uh, the guard was lucky; he got spared today. Yeah, nothing in here. It's really interesting. They have the gallows. You can't go inside any of these buildings, sadly. You can shoot them, but that's all. Black post. And like over here, there's more buildings, and there's. A spiral staircase in some of these towers. I'll show you the one over here. In one of the buildings, the windows, like the windows glitch, so you can just look through it, which is really weird perspective, because you just see like the building was hollowed out. Like, nothing was ever in there. Nothing ever will be in there. Which I thought was pretty funny. And in here too, strangely, it just the towers unloaded. Usually. Like, last time I was up here, this was all loaded in, but I guess it's, the game's just kind of bugging out right now. Which is a bit unfortunate, because I didn't want to sh show you guys all the cool things you could do if I walk through here. Look at that. <laughs> I can just walk through the walls. That, isn't that cool? Ooh, did I risk it? Nah. I'm not going to risk it. Why am I stuck in the wall? That's, that's a bit... That isn't right. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Falling through Sisica right now. You don't, you don't even die, which is amazing to me. You just stand up. Yeah. Hit something that time. Look, most of the time there is a tunnel that should load in, and you can just freely walk around the underground of Sisica. Oops, a bit farther over here. But I'll try and get back into the prison to show you one more thing that you can do. Well, it should work. Sometimes it is a bit finicky, per se. 
go through the doors again. And this middle tower. This middle tower has a gate in it like all the other towers. And this is another way to get into the prison underground. You can even use it to climb up on top of the prison, which is what the other staircases do. And this one isn't even loaded either. So, yeah. Explore this for yourself, guys. Sometimes it loads, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes you can get to island, sometimes you can't. It was just really interesting to me. And I guess we'll end it off with a dock here. You know, something I did last time is me and a friend, we took a boat up the river here, got a prisoner, put him on the boat, and sailed him all the way to Sandany. Had a wild night. Speaking of prisoners, let's see if there are any. And if there are, we'll drop some in the tunnel and see what happens. Come on, horsey. Now, doing a quick scan, it doesn't look like there are any prisoners here, sadly. Which is a bit weird, because they spawned in last time for us, and you, you go into the underground last time, which is unfortunate. Is there a guard up there? Yep, there's a guard up there. The guards up there, they don't really do much, but there are guards on the ground. And I was hoping that there'd be more, just more NPCs around. It's just stuff to interact with for you guys, but... Oh well. I did actually find someone, now we're having a little bit of a shootout. With the lawmen of Sizuka. Well, not really lawmen, but the guards. What do you say we take a hostage and throw him overboard into the pit below? They stopped spawning already? Oh, that's not sad. Oh well. Can't win them all, I guess. Well, hmm. I guess we did win this one. But. Oh. Yeah, we won this one. Had our cake and ate it too. That's interesting. He actually dropped his gun. He's mm -mm. most. Huh. Like in on like in this toy mode. Now if we untie this guy, what's he gonna do? Oh, he's a pistol. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Let's get to know. They have pistols too. But we're just gonna try and escape this guy. I don't know how it's gonna work because I have the lot. Oh, yeah. Well, <laughs> I guess that's it. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Sweet Fontos. Goodbye. Untie him. Let's see if he runs. <laughs> uh, wrong way. Oh! We got a prisoner on the loose! He's at? No, he's bald for me. Uh, holy shit. Stop him. Recording again. Horn lantern's out. Uh, there's a tunnel! It's fully rendered. Look at that. Oh, yeah, maybe. And there's a staircase up here, too. Oh, this staircase leads directly up to the top of the- <gasps> Heidi! Look, does this seem familiar? Look. Do you think it's because I walked on the boardwalk on top of it? Yeah, I walked across the bridge on the top. That's so cool. back on the wall of you.